Hi, my name is Gabriela Dimitriades and I am going to show you how to look your best for any vacation or occasion with what is in my Sephora bag. All the products that you see here are from Sephora, from my recent trip to the Sephora store. You guys have to check it out. So I thought I was only going to take you through one look today, but I am so in love with the product that I've decided to take you through three of my essential vacation looks. Can't wait to show you. Let's start with a brunch with friends or a more daytime look. I feel like this is a more natural, easy look. I like to dot just a little bit of foundation. Right now I'm using the Bobbi Brown foundation, which I absolutely adore. So I use a tiny bit and I dot it all over my face and blend it in. I would normally use a concealer, but because this is a daytime look, I'm gonna give that a miss. I then apply a very little bit of pink blush on my cheeks. So this glow all over stick is simply bomb. It is from Nude Stick and I am in love with it. It's an incredibly soft formula and I love how it transitions so easily from day to night. And I love how it gives you a really glowy complexion. For this look, I like to keep it natural and just brush out the brow for a nice high definition. For me, mascara is a must for any look, especially if you're doing a really toned down look. I feel like you really have to define the lashes. So let's make it a little bit more fun now that we're on vacation. I'm gonna go for something a little bit more daring today. Yeah, I'm in a really good mood today and I wanted to convey that with my look, which is happy and glowy from within. So for this look, which is my night out on the town, I like to um, either go out with my girls or with my partner. And for that, I want something that's easy, light, fun, and still sexy. I like to ditch the foundation because sometimes that can give me a bit of a blotchy look. And on those nights, I like to use the concealer. This concealer from Lancome, which is my absolute favorite, has finally launched in India, and I'm so glad that they've done that. So the next step in my regime is the Bloom Palette by Natasha Denona. I'm quite obsessed with this, guys. You have to just see the shine. It's so lovely. I like to put it on my cheeks and on my nose sometimes. I just learned this cool trick on a Rihanna video where she kind of draws a C around her eye and places the stick on her brow bones. Next up, which is actually the main focus of my look, is a smoky eye. I love this palette and uh, I love to start a little bit darker, going a bit lighter, adding a bit of shimmer in it. It gets a bit messy, but I like how it turns out. Next up is the smudge proof stick from Smashbox, which I really need because I am very bad at putting on eyeliner. So this one really helps and it is definitely a special part of my makeup liner. Next up is some mascara to finish off the eye. Seeing the focus here is the smoky eye. I'm going to go with a nude lipstick. So this is a really quick look. I have guests coming over. I'm gonna be really busy running around, making sure everything is in place. So go with what works for you. I don't experiment much with concealers, especially now that I found my new favorite concealer in the Lancome Tint Ideal. And for now, a little bit of blush. Glowing skin never goes out of style. And now for a little bit of shimmer around the eyes. A look doesn't come together without mascara and this one is perfect for any occasion because it gives you great volume and great definition. Now who doesn't want that? I personally hate dry chap lips so this one is good for you girls who have that all year round. I never leave without this. This baby is a must-have in my Sephora bag, in my makeup bag and in my vacation bag. Well, that was super fun, and now I am all set for my vacation. Goa, of course. I'm a total beach bum and can't wait to be back. And I hope you guys learned something from my In Sephora bag today, and I hope to see you in Sephora stores soon.